no one does it better than Sean. Having been a lawyer previous to getting into the real estate business and being in public relations, running political campaigns, I, I can tell you from experience that you know he really has got what it takes. He knows his business better than anyone. And I was a Caldwell banker before and felt that really this was the place to go. When he first started in the business, I kept telling my manager at Caldwell Banker, you know, Sean's doing X, Sean's doing Y, why aren't we doing that? And they got so sick of me, you know, saying that all the time. They're like, well, why don't you work for Sean? I said, you know what? I will. And I did. And I left. Several years ago, I used to work for Prudential, and uh, Sean had approached me to uh, come to work for him, and I had heard what a progressive company he had. Uh, he has been probably one of the most progressive people in the real estate industry that I have come across. And I am very, very pleased to be working with him because I think that uh, where he's going to go from here is going to be phenomenal. I worked for a small boutique, which was my own, Long Island Real Estate. I've been doing this for 24 years and uh, I decided if I made a move or I were to sell my business or to be part of a larger company, I would only do that with someone who I thought was making moves, that being Sean. And um, I had opportunities to go with other very large companies. He was the one that I thought uh, was the most creative. I anticipated that the market was going to have a downturn and I knew that um, I needed to go with someone who was going to be able to address it head on and then find the answers and the solutions to make you succeed. We work on commission, so really it's up to us to find out which company offers us the best support. And when Sean, Sean was not in business when I went into business, and as soon as he went into business, I just watched him blaze an amazing track, and, and fortunately he asked me to join, and I was only too happy because I knew his company was going big places. When he markets a house, he's very creative. Um, he, he does things different than the other agencies, and I think that's what gets his houses sold quicker um, than our competition. I just love his energy and how he, you know, he's so positive about everything. He never puts you down or he never makes you feel like you're not going to make any money or, you know, he's, he's like, he's there for you. I can call him at middle of the night and he'll answer my phone call. You know, that's what I love about him. He's different. He's unique. It's not like going to work every day. This man is known to spend money and sellers want a, a broker that spends money. They want a broker to invest and believe in their product. And that's what he does. He gives you the red carpet, as you know, um, beautiful brochures. He shows up in his fancy car, luxury real estate. Everyone knows him when he drives through town. And I just think that he's um, very non-typical, very smart, brilliant, but extremely creative. And uh, I think he's created a niche in the luxury market and slowly, like, slowly and surely, like building your home with bricks, the word is out and people recognize him, and I'm proud to be part of it. And the most prestigious award in the history of Sean Elliott Luxury Homes and Estates. <laughs> this is the highest volume award. This is the head honcho. This is the agent who made the most money, the agent who could fly private, fly whatever they want. The 2009 highest sales volume award goes to Brand Nazer. Everything that he has always offered us as agents, we're always one step ahead. And then we always saw the other agencies, you know, come up and offer their agents the same thing, you know, six months or a year after that. So he's always been a beat and a step ahead of what the other agencies offered that. So I think that he's just a very innovative man. I think he really is a marketing uh, genius. He does things very differently than the rest of, of the gang. He is very innovative, thinks of things that uh, people are not doing, really progressive, um, always kind of a step ahead of the curve. Had a great open house in um, Brookville two weeks ago to launch his magazine. 
in that respect he brought in buyers, he brought in sellers, he brought in publicity, things that we would not have benefit from as agents in an overall capacity had we not had that type of innovative thinking. So you need that in this type of market. And if you don't have someone who changes with the market, then you're not going to be able to grow and to be able to grasp the future market. We've done deals over the phone at Sunday nights at 11 o'clock at night, and we're negotiating you know, $5 million properties. This is not like a regular company. You know, a big company where there's a thousand agents and there's many offices, you're never gonna get that guy. You're gonna get the manager, or you're gonna get somebody way down the food chain. To be able to, as an agent, which is very important to me, the business that I do, to be able to call the owner on a moment's notice and he answers the phone, very important to me. The support staff is wonderful. Um, we have admins in every office and our admins put our listings in, they do our brochures, they help us every step of the way getting our listings on the computer, getting our postcards out, getting our brochures done, getting our uh, open houses in. Because we have so many different aides who are working for us that they can always get whatever we need done and done quickly and accurately and they're really just a terrific bunch. When you're selling a house and you're selling a house for multi-millions of dollars, you have to be on top of everything. You have to know the photographer's going to be there on time. You have to know that the pictures are going to be professional, that the website's going to be updated. All these things that they do, they do for you. They do for the agent. You could just pick up the phone and call Sean, and Sean will talk to you, and he'll try to help you. And um, I find the agents also very supportive. I'm always uh, eager to give you a helping hand. The people that I work with also plays a very important part because I love all the co-workers, all the people that we work together. We are always going out for dinners and we, we have like a family, all of us, all the agents. So because of that atmosphere and Sean being there for us, we will I don't know, he's just different. He When I go with on listing appointments with him, I see how he talks to the people and how he communicates and how he's so confident and just brings out the best in me when I'm with him. We are really supportive of one another. There's enough to go around and if someone is doing something and involved in something, um, the rest of the team will really rally and try very hard to support what you're doing. If our admins are not available, we can go to other <coughs> offices and they will facilitate whatever we need. Mm -hmm. promptly. Um, everything we ask for is done. Andrea and I recently got a land deal um, of townhouses in Garden City because of what the admin and the manager was able to offer to us to send marketing to this particular business, these particular business people where others, and we're talking about Daniel Gale and Prudential, were not able to accomplish. And ultimately, we got the deal. So to me, it's, you know, there's no place like being at Sean Elliott Luxury Homes from the support staff, the agents, you know, the camaraderie. We really get things done. I mean, we have the quality in terms of everything from the way we do our open houses to our brochures, our magazines. I mean, everything is top notch. And really, there's no place I'd rather be. And he envisions such great things for his company that I can't help but want to be a part of it for as long as I can and do what I can to enhance his, his company. When we start getting to a point where we've seen it and we've done it, he comes up with something new. He does a party. He gets models to go in a pool and swim around so everybody can get excited about a house. Things like this have never been done before in our industry. Working for a guy like that, it's exciting. It causes the agents to want to bring their A game all the time. You come with a B game, you might as well go work for somebody else. It's This Ball TV.